Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to today's video. We are playing NFL Grid. If you don't know what NFL Grid is, pretty self-explanatory. You're going to see right here in a second. As you see, we have a 3x3 grid with a bunch of teams and some Super Bowl MVP and Steve Smith. You're thinking, what's going on? And if you guys know uh, media at all, you probably played this game already. It's uh, basically trying to match up the grid with the items in the X and Y axis. That's right. I learned a lot in that... Uh, algebra class or geometry class whatever it was so basically let's start off with something like this the new england patriots my new england patriots who are extremely horrible and i hope they draft a quarterback i have to match up somebody who played with the patriots with somebody who played with the new orleans saints so one very easy for me would be the brandon cooks so i'd go here type in brandon cooks and would tell me wide receiver 2014 still plays currently plays with the dallas cowboys that guy is a journeyman of wide receivers. He's played for so many teams, but I know for a fact he played with New Orleans and the Patriots. Right there, 67% guess Brandon Cooks, but that's still the right answer. So we have to do that for all these grids here. Uh, there's no reward, but they do these every day and they're pretty fun, so. All right, now, because I know the Patriots like back of my hand, Super Bowl MVP for the Patriots. I mean, who else are you going to put besides... How the hell do you spell Julian? That's right. My Super Bowl MVP, Super Bowl 51? Did he win at 51? I know he won at some point. I know he won at some point. And then the, and then somebody who played with Atlanta Falcons and the Patriots, that is Cordero Patterson. Punt return, God. Although not anymore, not with the new rules. Not with the new rules, can't be punt returning anymore. No, 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 change that all up. 39%, I'm trying to think of somebody else big who played for uh, us in Atlanta. But speaking of Atlanta, uh, one of the greatest tight ends to ever live who played with the Kansas City Chiefs and Atlanta Falcons is Tony G. Gonzalez. There's a lot of Tony G's. 2013 to retired. I didn't, even, I didn't even recognize that. All right, well, so we got here. Oh, the Honey Badger, Tyran Matthew. Tyran Matthew. Free safety. I think, yeah, he still plays for New Orleans right now. Well, wow, 81%. So, I mean, there's no really benefit to guessing a low percentage. Like, obviously, a lot of people here would have picked Tom Brady. But I picked a true Patriot, someone who didn't leave us. So, I picked Edelman. And 22% of people picked Edelman. I assume, like, 70 or something would have picked Brady. But, obviously, there's other answers. You can choose, like, lower percentage, uh, percentage answers. Uh, but, off the top of my head, I don't know who won the first Super Bowl with, with Kansas City. Who won the MVP. So, I'm just going to go with the uh, overliable. Just say Patrick Mahomey. Now we get to a little more difficult section. Played with Steve Smith. Uh, nobody else besides good old Joe Flacco. Elite 99.91%. .91%. I wonder who the other 0.09% is who played with Flack, uh, who played with Steve Smith. Uh, New Orleans and Atlanta. Off the top of my head, I can't think. Uh, the only I remember him playing in Carolina. I'm trying to think. Dude, I don't. I I, I could have sworn he played in New Orleans. Let's go. With, was it Ted Ginn? Why do I have a feeling it was like Ted Ginn Jr. or Ted Ginn Sr.? I I'm pretty sure Ted Ginn played with Steve Smith in Carolina. I'm. Or no, uh, no. Oh God, I don't know now. Oh my God, he actually did. That's crazy. Uh, Atlanta and Steve Smith. I have no clue. I'm going to assume a quarterback. Uh, I mean, Matt Ryan definitely didn't. Uh, we, could, we have one guess left. I'm almost certain Matt Ryan did not play with Steve Smith. Thinks, I'm like almost 100% certain he did not, but I don't have another answer. So we're just going to put in Matty Ice. Damn, who the hell was it? Matt Schaub. The other. The other Matthew. Wow, 11% got that one. 21% got Ted Ginn. Yeah, I'm, I pulled that one out of my uh, you-know-what, because I was not going to get that right. So that is basically this game. Uh, but we can also go and play a previous NFL grid, like 270... What's today? 273? Nope, 272. So we can go here and go to 271 and play this one. And right off the bat, I can tell this one is a little more tricky. Uh, yeah, Chargers and Giants. Giants and... I feel like I know one for this one. I'm not 100% sure, though, but Giants Super Bowl. I think it can be anybody who played for the Giants. So, obviously, you're going to see Eli Manning. But, no, former Patriot, 
Deion Lewis won a Super Bowl. 0.24%. That's crazy. That's wild. He was small. I remember he played for Tennessee too. Uh, one team only. Uh, I think. Patrick Mahomes just, just make it easy I know I'm sure there's another like fun answer out there but I'm just gonna go with Mahomes oh, 22% played with LT and won a Super Bowl oh uh, Drew Brees duh that's right I forgot he played in uh the Chargers the Chargers and the Giants were throwing me off so much I was thinking of the Philip Rivers trade right I'm thinking Drew Brees is the one who played with the Chargers I think oh you know who else played with the Chargers it was uh Tyrod Taylor that guy's also a journeyman. I know that one's right. Yep. Alright, one team for the Chargers. Let's come up with a fun answer here. Obviously, the easy one would be like Justin Herbert or something. Uh, we could go with... I feel like an... There we go. I, I, I had to dig into my brain a little bit. 5% for there. Alright, that's good. That's good. We got a little bit of diversity going on now. One team... The one t NFL team that... Very easy. I mean, you could just go ahead and pick Jaden Reed if you want now. These are the very easy ones. 3% for Jaden Reed. I feel like a lot of people would pick Jordan Love. Green Bay and played with LT. I don't know. Chargers and played with LT. Obviously, I would have to guess my boy, Pride and True. Indianapolis Colts legend. Uh, did I spell his name wrong? How do you spell Philip Rivers? Is it not like this? Oh, okay. It's, it's one L. That's why. Philip Rivers. Now, these two... I'm not entirely sure. Uh, I know Blake... Is it Blake Martinez I'm thinking of? I don't think so. I, I I can't get it through my head. I don't know. We're gonna... Uh, I don't know. Gosh, I feel like there's an easy one for here. I don't know. With stuff like this, I'm just gonna go and give up. Because I'm just curious. It was Blake Martinez, damn it! Mark Brunel. I wouldn't have gotten Mark Brunel. I wouldn't have gotten him. The Madden legend, Mark Brunel. Also, Easter eggs just came out in Madden, so I gotta start uh, grinding for those. But let's go to 270. We'll do like one or two more. I mean, I'm having pretty fun. Oh boy. Oh boy. Top 32 draft pick, Anthony Richardson. Okay, top 32 draft pick. I'm pretty sure that would be our boy, Derek Henry. Even though he, does, even though he doesn't play for them anymore, we can still... I'm an idiot, dude. I was, I think he was drafted in the second round, Derrick Henry, was he not? Second, third, it was whatever, it was the trade that they got a bunch of picks from the Rams when they drafted golf. I'm an idiot, they just wasted that. Top 32 pick with 10 picks thrown, let's go with, oh, yeah, right, I, can, I can go with Peyton Manning. Because you can't double up, like if this one was Broncos and I want to do Indy and the Broncos, uh, I couldn't do Peyton Manning again. 10 picks thrown, let's go for S Sam Bradford? Okay, 3% for Sam Bradford. Good, good. Go. Let's try and get gold all the way down here. I feel like Desmond Ritter. Oh, gosh. I feel Mat Matty Ice is the obvious one. Matty Ice is the one that everyone's going to pick. I'm going to guess... Oh, boy. I want to get all gold. I, I don't know if gold is like 5% or less, but... Oh, boy. Quarterback who played the Falcons. Marcus Mariota played for the Falcons. I'm fairly certain he did. I don't know if he had, I assume he had 10 interception season. Oh. Whoa, pause. Marcus Mariota can be used for the top 32 pick, though. Do, how bad do we want this? Can I name another person that was drafted by Tennessee? I'm going to go with the yes. Like, we're just going to figure it out as we go, because I really want to get gold all the way on the bottom. He wasn't even gold. Ah, oh, that sucks. Well, there goes that. I don't know if we're going to get that one now. Cordell Patterson didn't play for any of these. Top 32. Dude, I am like blanking right now. Who did they just draft? Didn't they have like a really good old lineman? Oh, it's gonna kill me. It wasn't Will Levis. I don't think Will Levis. I think it was in the second round. Oh my gosh. Dude, I'm drawing a blank. I don't think Chickaconquo was. I know Traylon. Maybe Traylon Burks? Let's do another one. Let's see if we can think of another one here. I feel like this should be easy, but I just I can't think I can't process I used up all my like thinking power in the other ones uh, Cardinals and Colts dude. I'm drawing a blank. I can't think of anything Can I get like a hint? I'm like drawing a blank. Oh my gosh Hopkins dude that little stint 
That's just where wide receivers go to die, is Tennessee. That's crazy. I can't believe it took me that long to remember Hopkins. You know who else was another wide receiver that went to Tennessee and was just completely washed after that? Who also played for Atlanta? Julio Jones, dude. Like, why am I blanking on these people? Is there another receiver that I'm thinking of here? I mean, this one could have also been Calvin Ridley now, but I don't think it tracks it until they play the snap. Uh, if that makes sense. I'm going to try Traylon Burks. I, I I don't think it is. I don't know if he was drafted in the first round. Oh, he was. Oh, my God. Oh, dude, dude. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We, we got to focus up right now. We got to focus up. I, that was our last guess. Damn it. Was this one an easy one? Edgar and James. I, maybe if I thought about it long enough. I can't believe it took me that long to get those final four. I can't believe that. I like. I knew Traylon Burks. Oh, I'm an idiot. We'll do one more. We'll do one more. Two six nine. Damn, she fine. Ooh, a Patriots one. Alrighty. What do we got here? One hundred plus draft pick. Fine. I'll go Edelman again. Ooh, wait, wait, wait. Can, can he be used for one team only? Oh no, one team only is only over here. Edelman. Nine percent. I feel like everybody said. Brady. Uh, 100 plus pick for Detroit. Uh, not Gibbs. Not Goff. Not Laporta. Not Hutchinson. I don't think Darius Slay was. I'm uh, definitely not Calvin Johnson or Matt Stafford. I don't know. Uh, one pick who was one. Oh, see, good thing we didn't pick Brady for that one because now we can use Brady for this one. See? Perfect. Dude, I, I'm stupid. My brain did not function there, dude. That's crazy. I'm an actual idiot. I'm an actual idiot. Okay, we're gonna lock in. I'm gonna focus as much as I can. We're just going for easy answers now. We're just gonna go Lamar Jackson. Action Jackson. Oh, there was a cornerback Lamar Jackson. That's right. Can't pick that. One team only for Seattle. Let's go with, uh, oh, what's their cornerback? Witherspoon. Devin Witherspoon. 5%. Good, good, good. Seattle. I feel like there's an easy one here. Now I'm missing. I can't believe I can't think of a Patriot and a Seahawk. Uh, quarterback. Not Hoyer. There was another one. There's another quarterback that we had that played with Seattle. I don't know. I can't think of it. Odell? No. Dude, I feel like nobody played for Detroit that I can think of. Quandre Diggs? Did Quandre Diggs play for them? Uh, I know he played for at least one of them. Let's go, dude. Locking in. Locking in. Uh, but the 100 draft pick for one team only. Uh, this should be an easy one, but I'm literally completely blanking right now. Oh, okay. Anna Fry. Okay, we're looking good. We're looking good. Wow, 30, 36% of people picked Brock Birdie. Alright. Dude, we got a lock in here. We have three guesses left. We're doing very well today. I usually don't do this good. I don't play this every day, but uh, I'm playing it now. Oh, 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 oh. Kyle Van Noy. Kyle Van Noy. Let's go. I remember that one. He played for a lot of teams after he left us. He played for us, Baltimore, the Chargers, and Miami. I think that's all the team. I played for Baltimore last year. Okay. <laughs> we got to lock in one more time. Patriots and Seattle. Dude, I can't believe I just thought momentarily that Brady only played for one team. That's how drilled into my brain that is. Like, we didn't get any of their, run, like, Chris Carson or anybody. Uh, I don't think we shipped off any of our cornerbacks to there. I don't think Welker or anybody played there. And, I, and this one, I, I got no clue. I cannot draw a comparison for these two. But I gotta think of a Detroit 100 plus pick. That's the easiest one I want to get right now. I don't know when he was drafted. I assume it would be in the later rounds. Okay, he was. I mean, I, I'm pretty sure he was drafted by the Rams, but... Uh, we got one guess left. Oh, boy, I got no clue. I'm just going to type in... I'm just, let's just go McCord. Like, I know McCord didn't play for them, but... And the off chance that he did. Damn, who was it? Michael Bennett, bro? I completely forgot he even played for us. I would have not have gotten... Uh, Probably Lodi and Nagata. I got no clue. 
A golden tape, Metcalf. Yeah, yeah, yeah. These were all obvious. Metrodon. That's been today's video, guys. If you guys like NFL Grid, uh, let me know. I'll do more of this. I mean, it's, it's fun. It's easy to record. And I, I, it's something I suck at. So you guys must love it. But that being said, that there is a new South Park game that just came out this week that I really want to try out. So if you guys are interested in that, let me know. I'll do a Let's Play on that. It looks really fun. There's also another game coming out soon that I'm going to be doing a Let's Play on. Anyways, that's the end of today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed today's content. Leave a like and a comment down below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.